Hi. Hello. How are you? I hope you're well, because today we're going to talk about ScanPro and PowerScan. By the end of this video, you'll be able to load a ScanPro scanner, and you'll be able to navigate the PowerScan software. More importantly, you will be able to say with confidence that you can use microfilm. And that's an icebreaker. Microfilm was invented in 1859 and is simply film containing microphotographs of printed material such as newspapers or city directories. The film is read by using a reader or scanner and these readers have changed significantly in the last 100 years. The first thing you will need to know when using microfilm is how to load the scanner. First, place the reel on the left peg. Then, take the film and place it under the roller and through the two pieces of glass. On the other side, place the film under the roller again and secure it onto the permanent reel on the right. On the computer, you can now launch the PowerScan program by double-clicking the red icon. Once in the program, select the appropriate film size. The first thing you will need to understand when using PowerScan is how to navigate the film. This is the motorized roll film control. This button at the top can be dragged left and right to move forwards and backwards at your own pace. The fast forward and rewind buttons allow you to navigate at a much faster pace. Returning to our computer screen, you will notice how we use these controls to locate the first image on the reel. And this is footage of the scanner moving at this pace. For comparison, this is the scanner when you use the fast forward button. The next thing you will need to learn how to use are the various features which enhance how you view the film. The rotate 90 degrees icon allows you to rotate the screen to an appropriate orientation and the zoom icon changes the magnification of the image. The auto adjust icon automatically fixes brightness, contrast, and straightens the image. The brightness icon allows you to adjust the image's brightness, and the contrast icon lets you change the image's contrast. The last function you will want to be able to do is save images from the microfilm reel. You can do this by either saving the image to the computer's hard drive or by saving it to a portable USB drive. some fun. Hopefully you've learned a few things, like how to use PowerScan. Of course, you may be asking yourselves why. Why? Why? Why indeed? But I'm here to tell you, microfilm isn't going anywhere. For a while. And that's because it saves space. In fact, 2,500 images can fit on one roll of film. In an age where space is a premium, this is invaluable for libraries. Also, it's durable. It can last for 500 years. Isn't that comforting? Used to 179 years of history, and hopefully, 179 more. Thanks for watching.